Hi Vibrant Tribe, it's Ronika here from True Vibrant You and Mind, Body and Soul. So guys, update. I'm going through another major shift. Like, can you freaking believe it? <laughs> um, yeah, so with this whole thing that went through with the business and everything, uh, it has just come to that point where I have to make that choice. Luckily, I'm not doing it alone. Um, but yeah, actually gave notice for this flat today and really sad guys, really sad. Um, you know, I really loved staying in this property. It's been really amazing. I know the first day that I walked in here and I saw the sun coming through and the garden, there was no grass and the garden beds was a mess and there was no step to step outside and you know, we built the little steps and put the edging in and the grass and the plants and my plant wall. You know, it was really so amazing to, you know, create something. And the landlord was so amazing. You know, he's just like, it's fine. Take it off the rent. You know, you're improving the property. You know, it is so rare to find, guys, where you actually get a landlord that says, make it better and take it off the rent, you know. And this is was really a beautiful area. So many trees. Uh, Douglas Dale is really, really stunning. I do love Joburg North. It's really, really beautiful. Um, yeah, so it's really sad to see it go, guys. It's sad to see it go. And I know I said, like, I'm not really attached to things. <laughs> um, but... It is still sad to think that I'm going to have to sell everything by the end of this month. You know, I'm going to have to cut back completely and move to a suitcase. You know, at least before when I got divorced and everything, I, you know, I did sell everything, but I bought new stuff. You know, it's like I sold the excess stuff and got new stuff, you know. Um, so this time I'm going to, you know, like sell stuff so that I can, you know, um, buy stock <laughs> and things for you guys to buy and to improve your lives, you know. So it's going to be quite a shift, I must say. Like today I was really, I had those moments where I'm just like sad, you know, sad that I'm like, I'm going to have to cut down quite a bit, you know. And instead of being sad and, you know, anxious, I must just be excited, you know, like this is a new journey, you know, who... Who knows where I'm going to end up, you know. So instead of being too sad, I need to be a little bit more, you know, enthusiastic about it. So I'm trying. I'm trying. It's hard, but I'm trying. But like even today when I was sitting outside, I'm like, you know, like the plants, you know, I'm going to have to get rid of my plants. You know, I can't put them in a suitcase with me, you know. Um, so, and, and I nurtured them and I love them so much. <laughs> Um, so I'm going to have to let them go and let them get new homes, you know. Um, so it's going to be quite an adjustment. So wish me luck with that. And But yeah, I can do this. Um, I've done it before, but not at this scale. I'm not quite sure how things work. Um, like especially we've got lots of loans and things we need to repay. So I'm not quite sure how this is going to play out. But I have had other friends that have gone through something similar and... You know, they say it's going to be okay in the end. It's just like, you know, they can't stop you from living, you know. So quite, quite a shift, guys, quite a shift. Um, I must say I didn't expect this just from one um, adventure that went south, you know. Um, but it was an experience. And like I said, I learned a lot from it. Um, learned to be very cautious, um, you know trust my intuition and you know and it's fine it's fine these things happen every day to different people so you know it's just a learning curve and I'll find a way through it you know and at least I'm not alone I've got an amazing partner like you know he's my soulmate um, love him to bits I've got my two third kids as long as I have my two third kids I'm fine you know so I'll find a way through this so wish me luck on this new shift uh, it's going to be quite, an, quite a story. Watch how it progresses. Hopefully it's going to turn into a beautiful fairy tale. Like all my other adventures that I thought was the end of the world and it ended up being a fairy tale. So I'm very excited to see what the universe is going to bring in my direction next. I hope everyone has a wonderful day. Chat soon. Bye.